who is not well recognized in this country, but honored and revered internationally. We are proud to say your good work speaks volume. And as a result, we should pass. In recognition of the above, we are awarding you with the distinguished award of the Golden Prophet of the Century. We will be going at all levels. See you as a catalyst, like Daniel and Joseph, to contribute spiritually in propelling the growth and development of this nation. Shall we put our hands together as we invite our father, the grand patron of the youth movement in Nigeria and diaspora for this great award. And as he's coming, I want okay. the Elisha to come forward too, because we have a gift for him. That's the two I see. <laughs> We thank God for life. We have a talking gift for him. For his faithfulness, loyalty, and dedication to service. This is the pillar holder. We are happy to celebrate with you, sir. this program. I'm here to speak about why we are here. We are here because we are celebrating the excellency of Jesus, the son of the most high God. We are here to celebrate the love of God that manifested in Jesus Christ. We are manifesting that love through the appreciation of the man of God. We are celebrating the faithfulness of the most high God in this ministry. We are celebrating 1 Samuel chapter 3 verse 19. And I want to say, as Baba Wendy is growing up, God is with him. And he did not allow any of his words to fall to the ground. We are celebrating that today. That is, God has been, and we continue to be, with the servant. And whatever I say, we come to reality. 
we are celebrating that. In verse 20, it says, All these strength from Dan to Bathsheba knew that Samuel had been established as a prophet of God. Today we are here to celebrate the fact that Baba Wali has been established as the mouthpiece of the living God in this generation. We are here because to celebrate one human factor that has been a jewel of inestimable battle, supporting, backing, encouraging the man of God. And that is Mama Dura Iya Baba Moni. We are here because we want to celebrate that woman of God because he has been a motivator. If the man of God has not had a woman, a mother of such an inestimable value, will not have been celebrating today. So we are celebrating the man, the woman behind what we are doing today. We are here because of the abiding faith. We are celebrating the fact that God has been God in this ministry. We are celebrating the fact and we are here today from Badamashi to Mabinu Ori. We are celebrating the fact that from that humble beginning, from that humble beginning, the message, the prophecy of the man of God, of Abraoli, has gone to the uttermost part of the world. Amen. Thank you very much.
this one is much for you. Because who are going to say that you go and follow? So I came to my video street last time I got to the job site. When I met him, he started telling me a lot of things beyond what was that. Something that will happen to be 10 years old. I look at him and I look at him. What was the thing? You know, after that, without having to waste your time, Every time I come to private, sometimes I present them as if I did not know what they are saying. I tell them, uh, private, you listen to yourself, you will repeat the same thing. That's where you know a man of God. You will repeat the same thing they have said before, without missing a word. So that's where I got to the documentary to me. I will tell you what three things I knew about him that Mabu and they are surprising. Each time I come to private, I've never seen, saw him asleep. Even if I came at 6 o'clock, you will see Prime Minister with And that is all back of somebody who wants to be some, from somebody's life. Because I remember, Chief Awuna of Prime Minister Group says, a man should not sleep more than four hours. Yes, because Prime Minister, your age, I got to know that. He was very, very thorough. I wonder, I uh, observed at close contact that I want to know when this people was. I've never, I saw him eating fruit during the past. But since Private Ayane eating, I've never met him. Because I've never been to his office and he would say, uh, Private is asleep, or he's eating, or he's busy. No. He had that time. Another thing is that Private Ayane. If he has something to do at 5 o'clock, then when <laughs> things were not there, he will be there by that third daughter. He will be tired of time for money, time management. That's what took him. Then, resilience. Well, well, well. I see him being very resilient in anything he do. He wants to pursue. I want to accompany That seal was always in him from the beginning. Um, there are some personalities who have met, and uh, in terms of preparation, in terms of prophecies, I told you, Professor uh, Gospel, you were late, Professor Gospel, you late now, I'm sure that that yeah, I remember you were late, that Celestia then, I think it was uh, the father, he was this father. But among all these people, because I remember Professor Iwale was predicted during his first brought to the 1979 elections. Guys, after Iwale came with the idea that he, the name Shamga is in the Bible, and that is the person that you can see that. So now I knew Professor Iwale opened to us. He was told that those ones are big. I've tested him several times. Not just me, so, uh, he did not ask me to go and say this. This is not a package testimony at all. Uh, not because he didn't even know that I was coming here. Most of the members who knew me for a long time have not been here. So, because there uh, like some churches where they package testimony, he did not package this testimony for me. I for friends know that. That's me. Yeah, and all those who, my colleagues who know me, know that I don't miss one when it comes to that. So, then, Prophet Ayodele, he was a shadow giver right on time. Even when he had nothing, when he had nothing, he was a shadow giver. Anyway, yeah. Shego Papa Tobi from CCC Police. God bless you, sir. You are welcome. Yes, a prophet of God, prophet, doctor. Shego Papa Tobi from CCC Police. I told you, no, no. It's a promise headquarters. Our body in time we join a kind job bella bear one. If a lot of you buy in here, God bless you.
We want to give an award to people who have really worked with the church. It's a reward from our Father. So please, if you hear your name, walk straight to the podium as follows. Bosse Inri. Bosse Inri. Bosse Inri. Put your hands together for Jesus as he comes.
From the voice that I hear, I never predicted it would be up to that point. That is when the voice of God is speaking on your life. See, I know a lot of people who are here to celebrate. We are here to celebrate. Baba, a man that grass is poor. You will grow. All of my churches, men, men, you buy in long. We are here to celebrate. We shall also come to celebrate. Thank you very much. All your faith. Then to my living legend, see I want a of music. Didn't worry, AJ. The Taiwo, I think they are the good dude. Taiwo and Taiwo, they don't do that. They want me to be very good. You know, see, Mori, but I was thinking, we saw the Loma. I was like, ah, I want to enjoy it. See me share with your son, dude. You know what? That's the bad day. What? I'm happy to see them here today. You know what? That's the bad day. One day, we need to drag your law. I'm not doing this. I will pray the Lord will continue to progress you. Oh, but I feel it. Only call of my routine. No silly of the dobo. Only for you to be there. Why? You're not my way. I'm not the only one who knows. Now you should be the first one to know. Only for you to be there. Why? Eh, we, we, only share your love. I Yeah. 
This is some of one thought. Why not? Wow. Yeah, you can do. This is some of one and fifty thousand era. Now, it did some of it for you. Know, what it be a good and more potential and more business in and money business. But the money pay, you need to a match one or two. You need to around what movie for you. What you need. Mrs. Orukoko. Hundred thousand. Oluko no Rashida. Fifty thousand. Daya Folabi. This is nice, Lomo. Dupe Adenuga. Nigo bono e she, nigo bono e she, I 
So we have, we have to call on the Ejibo branch. After critically examining the call of God upon our father's life and his contribution towards humanity in the last 30 years, as a prophet, a leader worth emulating, a motivator, a philanthropic and giver, a change agent, if you want to clap, you can clap. A father of the fatherless. A voice of the masses. A capital of peace who is full of wisdom. I think he deserves a round of applause. A prophet of personality. Who is not well recognized in this country, but honored and revered internationally? We are proud to say your good work speaks volumes. And as a result, we should part in building the youth to build the future. Don't even build the nation any longer. But when we build the youth, we are building the future of the nation. In recognition of the above, we are awarding you with the distinguished award of the Golden Prophet of the Century. We will be done with you and all others. See you as a catalyst, like Daniel and Joseph, to contribute spiritually in propelling the growth and development of this nation. Shall we put our hands together as we invite our Father? The grand patron of the youth movement in Nigeria and diaspora for this great award. And as he's coming, I want the Elisha to come forward too, because we have a gift for him. That's the two I see. We thank God for life. We have a talking gift for him. For his faithfulness, loyalty, and dedication to service. This is the pillar holder. We are happy to celebrate with you, sir. about why we are here. We are here because 
we are celebrating the excellency of Jesus, the Son of the Most High God. We are here to celebrate the love of God that manifested in Jesus Christ. We are manifesting that love through the appreciation of the man of God. We are celebrating the faithfulness of the Most High God in this ministry. We are celebrating 1 Samuel chapter 3, verse 19. And I want to say, as Baba Wendy is growing up, God is with him. And he did not allow any of his words to fall to the ground. We are celebrating that today. That is, God has been, and we continue to be, with the servant. And whatever he says, we come to reality. We are celebrating that. In verse 20, it says, All Israel, from Dan to Bathsheba, knew that Samuel had been established as a prophet of God. Today we are here to celebrate the fact that Baba Wali has been established as the mouthpiece of the living God in this generation. We are here because to celebrate one human factor that has been a jewel of inestimable value, supporting, backing, encouraging the man of God. And that is Mama Dura Iya Baba Moni. We are here because we want to celebrate that woman of God because he has been a motivator. If the man of God has not had a woman, a mother of such an inestimable value, will not have been celebrating today. So we are celebrating the man, the woman behind what we are doing today. We are here because of the abiding faith. We are celebrating the fact that God has been God in this ministry. We are celebrating the fact and we are here today from Badamashi to Mabinu Ori. We are celebrating the fact that from that humble beginning, from that humble beginning, the message, the prophecy of the man of God, of Baba Wali, has gone to the uttermost part of the world. Amen. Thank you very much.
Friday to work into our office at TNT. We think today, this is today, it was a new event. Close with a small pamphlet. Written in the pamphlet were some predictions about explanations, about sports, about Africa, about the world in general. I look at it with a purpose, purpose cap. And who is this man? After he left, he didn't discuss much. Uh, my colleague, my colleague then, was the after editor. He said, I shall go, you are the one who knows these people. Go and follow up. I said, because having been brought to that meeting, parliamentary meeting, in the 80s, 70s to the 80s, there were Professor God's power, Oye Wale. If anybody grew up to do that time, it was what? Who is showing predictions? It was good predictions, not actually prophecy. That's why I would take Professor Oye Wale was thinking that has passed. It wasn't a new one, though. It was a small family, and I went to it. I said, this one, this man should be. Because who had no knowledge? He said that you go and follow. I came to Mark Pedro Street last time I went to the job site. When I met him, he started telling the doctor things beyond what was that. Something that will happen to be 10 years old. I look at him and I said, What was the thing? You know, after that, without having to waste your time, anytime I come to practice, Sometimes I present them as if I did not know what you're saying. Then one person uh, friend it. You will see yourself. You will repeat the same thing. That's where you know a man of God. You will repeat the same thing they have said before. Without missing a word. So that's where I got to go closer to him. And yeah, I will tell you what three things I knew about him that Marvel and they are surprising. Each time I come to private, I've never seen, saw him. Asleep. Even if I came at 6 o'clock, you will see Prime Minister with And that is all back of somebody who want to be some, from somebody's life. Because I remember Shiba Wuna of Prime Minister Group says a man should not sleep more than four hours. Yes, because two Prime Minister your age, I got to know that. You was very, very thorough. Two, I wonder, I uh, observed at close contact that I want to know when this is I've never, I saw him eating fruit during fast. But since Prime Minister Ayode eating, I've never met him. Because I've never been to his office and he would say, eh, Prime Minister is asleep, or he's eating, or he's busy. No. He has that time. Another thing is that Prime Minister Ayode, if he has something to do at 5 o'clock, then when <laughs> things were not there, he will be there by that third daughter. He will be tired of time for money, time management. That's what took him. Then, resilience. Well, well, well. I see him being very resilient in anything he okay, He wants to pursue. I want to accomplish. That seal was always in him from the beginning. Um, there are some personalities who have met, and uh, in terms of traditions, that of prophecies, I told you, Professor uh, Gospel, you were late, Professor Gospel, you late now, I'm sure that that yeah, I remember you were late, that Celestia then, I think it was uh, the father, he was based on father. But among all these people, because I remember Professor Iwale once predicted during his first brought to the 1979 elections. That time, Iwale came with the idea that he, the name Shamga is in the Bible, and that is the person that you can see that. So now I knew Professor Grobe, Okunswa, he was so good. Now, those ones are big. I've tested him several times. 
not just me too. Mm. You did not ask me to go and say this. This is not a package testimony at all. Uh, not because you did not know that I was coming here. Most of the members who knew this for a long, long time have not been here. So, because uh, like some churches, we had a package testimony. He did not package this testimony for me. I have a place to that. That's me. Yeah, I mean, who those who, my colleagues who know me know that I don't miss one when it comes to that. So, then, President Harry he was a shadow giver right on time. Even when he had nothing. When he had nothing, he was a shadow giver. Hey, thanks for watching this video. Subscribe on our YouTube channel, subscription is free. You can call us on 0080597807 for your event coverage. Thanks.